lot of great things that we've done. So let's just kind of focus on today. We're looking back from the standpoint of yesterday. We'll do a very quick recap. But it's about, now what do you do? I know, and you probably have some shaping to do at the top still, and that's okay. But once we know where we're moving forward, what is wildly successful? Once we, once we have a shape behind the compelling imperative and the opportunity case, we have to have a way of getting there. And so, if we go back to look at yesterday, true identity. Remember that exercise that Mr. Phil took us through? What was the question? So you can what? So you can what? So you can what? That's a great prompter for us all to dig in deep. And then you spent some time in your trek groups crafting up your, your vision and compelling imperative and opportunity case. Um, any general questions? I know you probably haven't necessarily finished that top portion, but any general questions or insights that you thought about last night when you went home to process this, either deliberately or uh, not on purpose in your in your sleep? Any general questions? But you're fine, aren't we? Just this one. Any general questions or insights? Y'all resting. That's good. For me, as I like work on the continuously refine the elevator speech, and even just the concepts of what Mount Roots is offering, uh, this concept of, of assisting others in making connections uh, was something that was kind of a common theme throughout, and that term connections is, is something that definitely resonates. When you mentioned, um, you had a slide that was like rooted, like the thematic roots. Um, yes, so connections was like one for me. Good to know that it helps you in being able to be more refined when you're heading. Yeah. Excellent. Any other insights or just questions or 